Warning! Hydrogen and oxygen are generated in the electrolysis of water. Hydrogen and oxygen, when kept together, can be very flammable. Do not bring ignition sources near the electrolysis apparatus when in use. To separate water into hydrogen and oxygen through electrolysis, you will need water, preferably distilled, a container, baking soda, sodium hydrogen carbonate is the chemical name, two wires or alligator clips, a battery or a wall adapter, it has to be DC current, and aluminum foil. The first thing you need to do is fill your container with water. Now add some baking soda. Stir the baking soda until most of it dissolves into the water. Make the aluminum electrodes. Take some aluminum foil and fold it over. Attach it to your alligator clips or wires. I place the electrodes in my solution and I'm going to plug in the adapter. The bubbles on the left are bubbles of hydrogen gas and the bubbles on the right are bubbles of oxygen. Oxygen will come off the anode and hydrogen will come off the cathode. What's happening is that hydrogen ions, which are positive, gain electrons at the cathode and become hydrogen atoms, and oxygen is being oxidized from oxygen ions to oxygen atoms. It's better to use two carbon electrodes than two aluminum electrodes. They just work better. These are two rods of graphite, which I got from a battery following Nerd Rage's tutorial. You can see there are a lot more bubbles. The one in front is hydrogen and the one in the back is oxygen. Don't bring a flame near this because when hydrogen and oxygen are in a container together, they're very flammable, even explosive. This mixture of hydrogen and oxygen is nicknamed HHO. HHO has a lot of applications, from welding torches to running cars. If you don't have two carbon electrodes, you can just use two pieces of mechanical pencil lead, which is in fact graphite. The term lead is a common misconception. The reason why the bubbles are bigger is because there's less surface area for the bubbles to form, causing bigger bubbles. If there's more surface area, there's smaller bubbles, but in the same amount. Thanks for watching, and remember to be safe.